Imani Davis and Malik Bussey were unemployed and having trouble finding work before they heard about the culinary certification program being offered through the D.C. government and a local restaurant. I was really struggling until I signed up for this program and they helped me. Doing nothing, running the streets whenever I can, uh, but nothing. I was in and out of jobs. Now they both have good jobs and the skills they need to build a career. Now I could. I have some type of income coming in to where I can support myself. I want to build on, you know. It's a really fun and educational program. I got two types of certification, kitchen certification. How are y'all doing over here? The training academy was the brainchild of Bernard Brooks, co-owner of Henry's Soul Food Cafe, who started the program after he found out that the rec center across from one of his restaurants had an industrial kitchen that wasn't being used. Since we started the school, uh, it's been well over 100 that has come through and passed and have certificates, and um, a lot of them out have jobs already. They get their food handlers license, and management serve safe, management license, not just regular serve safe. Um, they also get kitchen cook certificate and knife skill certificate. Not only is the training free, the students all get paid by the D.C. government while they're taking the classes. Both Malik and Imani were hired by Brooks to work in his catering facility after they graduated. For both these young adults, the training they received changed their lives. Great. I wake up, go to work every morning. I'm really good. My life is good right now. <laughs> The program has been so successful, Brooks is opening a new school inside the new men's homeless shelter set to open soon in Southeast D.C. While he's the teacher, Brooks has also learned a few things from the experience. It really touched me to know that what we're doing is actually working within the community. Always try to give people a chance. You'll be surprised at what those that you give a chance to, what they'll do. In Southeast, Mark Seagraves, News 4. What an awesome program. This program, by the way, is funded by the D.C. government, and those interested can apply to get in the program through the D.C. Department of Employment Services. Awesome.